Video, video, video. Make it parts for this guy again, and we're using the small lathe. Oh, what do we got here? Submarine parts. Aha! Came in the mail. 700 feet of seawater. Wow! All right. Another one down here. Oh, oh, very heavy. This one is how many feet? Goes up to zero to seven hundred feet of seawater. Wow. All right, so since I'm building a submarine, I guess I'll need these. <laughs> I'll leave it there for now, like that upside. What? Sitting on. No, I'm, okay. Oh, we got the gears down here, so they go on a shaft. And I'm using the small lathe today for putting holes in the shaft, screwing it up a little more. So I'm using Inventor 3's lathe, a jet lathe. Let's get around here. <laughs> This is the lathe I was using the other day, and now we're on to this little guy. A lot of curly cues. Wow, yeah, there's a lot of curly cues down there, too. Okay, so that shaft is done. Measure it out to about roughly a thousandth of an inch. This accuracy right in this piece is not that necessary. It's all the different drills. <laughs> so, moving along. Oh, yes, I did get a microphone for this transceiver. That's the microphone. 100, 100 watt. And these telephone handsets are for this fellow down here. 100 watt. I'm sure it's a lot stronger than that with the RF amp. Let's just receive that. That's what I'm doing today, so kind of rushed. I gotta take a shower. Want to join me in the shower? Take a head of the shower. I don't know the answer. Mm. Yeah, that's a uh, little one. High voltage. Well. There we go. Just having a break, working on some other things. All right, well, that's gonna be a short video.